today we talk about heuristic optimization. One of the typical techniques is simulated annealing or SA. SA is a random search technique which use an analogy between the way in which metal cools and frees into a minimum energy substance. The algorithm starts with an initial state and temperature and then randomly changing the state into a new state. So basically here, um, the algorithm would try to find another solution which is very near the current solution and then compares the energies of the new state and the current state or basically compute and check the cost function to see if the cost function of the new state is lower than the cost function of the current state. If the new state has less energy, or basically the cost function is lower, or if it's a probability function e to the negative delta energy divided by the temperature, delta energy here is actually uh, delta of the cost function. So if it is less than a random value, then accept the new state as the current state. Let's look at an implementation in Python. So the function name is annual and it takes solution as the uh, argument. So first, you call a function namely cost to compute the cost function of the solution and store it in a variable namely old cost. The temperature, the minimum temperature is um, just this small, about one hundred thousand. And the loop is repeated until the temperature of one. So that is the outer loop here. At each temperature, the algorithm tries a number of solutions uh, for, let's say, n time, and n here is 100. And it can be other, any other values. So what it does is it try the neighborhood of the current solution. And let's say we have a new solution which is very near the current solution. What is the cost of the new solution? So we call the cost function and give it the new solution. It returns the new cost. And then check the acceptance probability function. Give it the old cost, the new cost, and also the temperature. So basically this uh, compute e to the negative delta E, delta energy, basically delta uh, cost, and divided by the temperature, T. And store the result in AP, acceptance property. 
So if AP is greater than a random value, then I set the solution. I set the new solution. And the new cost is stored in old cost. Then increase I by one and repeat this for 100 times. So at each temperature, you actually repeat uh, a number of times. And after that, multiply the temperature by alpha. So this is to simulate the cooling down process. And again and again, and eventually returns the solution and also old cost. <laughs>